Hi guys, you're watching PC Repair Guru Chan. Today we're going to show you guys how to download and install the Elder Scroll online. It's an MMO RPG and it's going to get stuck into it. As you can see here, I've already got our account with the Elder Scroll online. This is the website you want to go to for the official website and uh, actually download the game you can also download the game from steam which is which uh, it's more expensive on steam and uh, you can actually grab it for cheap i will uh, link the website in the description regarding that where you can actually buy the game cheap and just to show you guys uh, how it is you just gotta sign up with this uh, alice scroll website and uh, as you can see, I've got a normal edition of uh, Elder Scroll. Um, there's an imperial one with that where which it gives you the horse and the class to actually play. So what we're gonna do is we already clicked on the download link, and this is what you're gonna get. It's about hundred and something meg, and it's quite straightforward. Just all clicking on that and just waiting for a couple of seconds. Also, if you have any problems uh, downloading or installing this game, let us know in the below comment and we'll get in touch and we'll actually give you support regarding it. So right now I'm running on Windows 10. So this system is, the game is actually running on Windows 10. So the installation is taking place on Windows 10. So I'm kind of hoping there's no errors, if, but if there's any errors, I'll be able to fix it either way so I'm just gonna quickly just check what's happening okay as, as you can see here it's going straight to the game okay okay it's telling me to actually close okay then continue I read Okay, in Europe, I just go on desktop, yeah, defect, yeah, I'm gonna add that in as well, um, don't really need that because I think my system's already got that, and it's gonna install in here, okay, that's fine, install, and see how it goes, okay, it's installing defects, direct X, okay, once that is done, it's gonna allow it. Your internet, uh, your firewall might end up blocking the game, so you might want to allow it to uh, allow the access, which it will actually download the the files it needs. So since it's been ages since I last time actually booted up the game. Okay, I'm just gonna quickly just check the settings all the way. I'm just gonna leave as that. Cancel and it's not much of. Uh, okay, limited. Yeah, that's fine. Apply that, install, and see how much is. I think roughly about three gig. If I'm actually work, seeing that correctly, I think. 3 gig and uh, as you can see it's going to take quite a bit of time to actually um, download the game um, uh, I do have a 40 m megabytes of 40 MB connection with Virgin Media that's in UK um, shouldn't take too much time okay as you can see here it's downloading and it's gone to 1% and it's about close to 30 gig yeah, so I was thinking it's about three gig, but then I noticed you know it's got a couple of extra zeros in there. So um, that's what close to thirty gig. This is the longest, biggest files I had to download a game when it came to MMO compared to any other MMO I've been uh, actually got on my system. This is the one of the biggest so far I'm actually downloading. So. Um, so that will be interesting to, see, interesting to see what kind of features it has. So once that is done, I'm just going to skip this part and get right to the end. See you in a bit, guys. Okay, there you have it, guys. 
um, once it's uh, downloaded, it will apply the patches and it's completed. That's close to what? More than 30 gigabytes of data download. That's, more, that's the most uh, downloaded, downloaded gigabytes I ever had to do on a game. So all you need to do is click play and you shouldn't have any problems. If you do have any problems, do leave a comment below and we'll get in touch. And I'm just going to quickly just click on play and uh, check the settings just to see everything's there and just show you guys a basic setting you can actually go on. Okay, depending on your system. So the music will be kind of loud. So all I'm going to do is try to put it down so that you don't listen you don't hear the background music okay I tend to put that up and press E agree okay and agree again and agree again okay, how many times do you have to agree okay Okay, so remember my account. What I'm gonna do is punch it like that. And okay, login. And okay, it's telling me something's wrong. So I believe it's the firewall. If I disable it, see what happens. So, for example, if you have do have this problem, just disable the firewall just to check whether it fits the firewall blocking the game. Just put the password in again, and it seems it was the firewall. So you need to add. Okay, author you have to authorize uh, the computer as well. So you'll get an email sent, and you gotta put the code in there, which I will quickly do. Okay, once that is done, you just gotta put your code in there and submit. And it's quite straightforward. Also, um, since you disabled your firewall, um, you might wanna add it in the exception where you can actually. Allow. Okay, once that is done, it's tell you to check your country, which I'm gonna do. Um, United Kingdom, confirm, accept. This is the character I already had on. Um, I'm just gonna quickly just check the settings and just to see if I can full blast it. Yeah, it seems like it, it's uh, already on full. Ultra, ultra high. Depending on your graphic card as well, so I'm gonna consider that. So what I'm going to do is increase that to there, view distance, uh, tend to actually put it halfway, depending, you can always adjust, adjust it, so it's not an issue. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, apply. And the firewall doesn't seem to be a problem because I've already sorted the problem out for the firewall. That's the e ESET Smart Security. I did download this game on Google Google Chrome. The that installation file. Okay, so as you can see here. She's a bit cute, but hey. Um, what I'm going to do is just going to start this one. It's been ages since I last played. So I'm just gonna quickly just check. I do have a standard edition for this uh, Elder Scroll Online. I don't have the Imperial edition. So I'm just thinking of getting that. I don't know. I'm just still uh, thinking of whether I should get it or not. Okay, all my art preacher set skills are reset. Okay, uh, I'm kind of dead here right now. Which uh, I'm out of here. 
empty weapons. Thinking that was a bad guy. But anyway, it, there you have it. We shouldn't dawdle, so make it quick. There you have the game, guys. So what I'm gonna quickly do is just quickly just check everything's working here. So there's a view, guys. An awesome view, if you ask me. Keep in mind, just wishing you started this game, which is kind of awesome. Okay, thank you for watching. Subscribe. And like the video and do leave a comment below and if you have any problems regarding the story in this game, 